Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we are talking about something that I've been putting off for a while. I've kind of been just ignoring it, but we gotta address the elephant in the room. What the heck is going on with my edges? I don't even know where to start. My edges have been fine. My hair is pretty fine in general, but the closer that I get towards the front of my hair, I feel like it's a lot more finer and it's always been that way but I'm tired of accepting <laughs> that this is the way it is and this is the way that it's going to going to be because I feel like the older that I get the more my hair is just going to I don't know get thinner fall out I don't know and I can't have it I can't have it not over here I'll show you guys like some clips of what's been going on with my hair Like, where are my edges? Like, all of this? This is the right side of my head. Um, I don't know. I just feel like it could be a little bit thicker. Like, and this is left side I don't know which side is worse to be honest it's just mad sparse it's kind of been like that for a while and I kind of accepted it but I'm like I don't know I just don't feel like this is normal and the older I get I feel like maybe it's all in my head but I don't feel like it is I feel like it's getting worse that is the situation this is the right side doesn't it look thin it looks a lot worse when my hair is wet um, I feel like this side is really bad. Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what's going on. When I'm wearing a turban, this is all satin. Um, that's what I have on my head. This is, I don't think this is what has caused it. Hopefully, I can get it together and get them a little bit thicker. My edges, I just feel like they are very sparse and I feel like it's getting to the point where I'm like concerned a little bit. Like I said, my hair has been fine over here for as long as I can remember, honestly. It's just harder for me to retain length in the front of my hair more so than the rest of it. It could be because this part of my hair is way more fragile than the rest and I, I understand that so I have to be a lot more gentle to my hair, especially towards the front. But this edges situation, I just don't understand <laughs> and I need y'all to help me out. Okay. Initially, I thought it was my bonnet because I was using cheap bonnets, the one with like a com basically cotton around the brim of it, like around the perimeter. I can't even talk around the perimeter of it um, I stopped using those and that was only recently so I'm not expecting like any drastic changes because I basically stopped using that bonnet like a couple weeks ago I don't think it's anything that I'm putting on my hair because I either sleep in a silk or satin scarf or a bonnet I haven't been doing any like high manipulation styles like I don't wear tight things around my edges it's not like I've been wearing braids and if I wear my turbans I don't wear them tight I wear them all the time because I just like them <laughs> and it gives me an excuse to leave my hair alone I haven't had my fingers in my hair if anything my hair is braided up under here moisturized and you know fine and even when I wear like a turban on my head I make sure that I have 
something that is silk or satin underneath it um, to prevent my hair from drying out and whatnot. So I feel like I'm doing everything right. I can't think of anything that could be making my edges thin like this or like thinner than usual it leads me to believe that I have some kind of like deficiency or something going on I do have um, hypercalcemia which is basically my parathyroid overproduces calcium and that can cause like fatigue and a whole bunch of other things which um, I know thyroid issues can cause your hair to thin out and shed a lot but I've had that for a while and I just feel like my edges are getting worse maybe it's just age I mean I'm 27 I think <laughs> so I don't know I know as we get older our body changes everything changes so I try to eat healthy I am drinking more water hold on I'm really am thirsty I've been talking a lot today <laughs> So what am I going to do to address the situation? So I try to eat healthy. I'm trying to drink more water. I'm going to go to the doctor and I'm going to get a blood test to make sure that everything is up to par. Make sure I don't have any other deficiencies that could be causing my edges to thin like this. Like my nails grow really long. Um, I do have, I do feel like my hair sheds a lot more than the average person. And I think that has to do with my hypercalcemia, but that's why I went into Ayurveda because it had helped me to reduce the amount of shedding that I get. I could be just overreacting and maybe it is like a normal amount of shedding, but I just felt like my hair shed a lot more than like the average person. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. I also need to look into a new multivitamin. I have not been taking a multivitamin. I am going to incorporate more massages to my scalp. Not anything too crazy because I know like if you go in and massage your scalp too vigorously that can like cause breakage especially because my edges are so fine as it is. So if I am going to be massaging my edges I think I'm just going to like do something like this where like I'm patting the product in and just moving the skin on my face I'm not like rubbing or anything like that that's the plan and I will keep you guys updated like after I come back with my blood tests and results and things like that to make sure everything is up to par and this just goes to show believe it or not no one has hair that's absolutely perfect especially in your natural hair journey you will have ups and downs and I don't want to come on here making it seem like my hair is completely healthy like I said, I'll keep you guys updated and as always, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye!